Welcome to the program. We begin this Christmas Eve with an unusual take on a tricky question faced by all families. When your time is up, how do you want to go? Now, Far from being a morbid subject, alternatives to the traditional burial or cremation have become a creative global business. You can now have your remains turned into a diamond, transformed into a vinyl record, or, as Helen Wellings reports, a far more spectacular option. We provide a happier farewell for people. When the time comes, can there be a more fitting way than going out with a bang? The deceased's ashes sent into eternal space or incorporated into a fireworks display. So the fireworks in this display represent all that she was and will always be. May the fireworks begin. You see people leaving our displays with huge smiles on their faces from the excitement of the fireworks, and yet with sort of tears running down their faces saying goodbye to their loved ones. Fergus Jamison of Heavens Above Fireworks in Essex in the UK says Aussies send loved ones ashes to be packed into rockets and fireworks. These rockets actually um, are for an Australian called Rosemary Seligman, who was an author. As fireworks can't be freighted, family and friends travel over for farewell ceremonies, dispersing ashes into the heavens. They're a sailor. It might be that we put these fireworks on a cliff over the sea. Or if they're a golfer, we can do it perhaps on the golf course. So these fireworks, when they go off in big volleys, perhaps at the end of the display, will completely fill the sky. Uh, with, with either glittering down fireworks or big bursts all over the place. And, and it really is a very dramatic ending to the display. The cost? Around $500 for four rockets. And fireworks displays start at $4,000. Heavens Above Fireworks also offers memorial space flights into Earth's or the Moon's orbit, or deeper into outer space. They're for people that really want to go to heaven. Fly me to the moon. And spin for eternity. Have your cremated ashes mixed into vinyl in a pressing plant for your limited edition custom made record. A UK company, appropriately called And Vinyly, uses a recording of your favourite tunes, your voice singing a special song, giving a speech, or even reading your last will and testament to be heard beyond the grave forever. From around $430 to $5,000 for multiple discs. Includes artwork for the cover. I had this stone made from Peter's ashes so that he's with me always and like everybody tells me, he's still wrapped around my little finger. Sandra Wheelhouse lost her husband Peter to blood cancer last year. She's also ordered a pendant stone made up from his ashes. It is definitely a constant reminder and that he's with me and um, it's comforting knowing that he's there. The beauty of these gems is they're made from cremated remains and you can have them with you 24 hours a day. Bunurong Memorial Park Crematorium in Victoria's Dandenong is the sole agent in Australia for Life Gem, a US company which converts ashes to stones. Chief Operating Officer Jane Grover says they're made from carbon, like normal diamonds, found in cremated ashes. They're shipped to the States, Chicago. The cremated remains go in a diamond press and then they're cut into an emerald or a princess cut or a heart-shaped diamond. Entry cost is around $2,000. Two out of three people choose cremation over burial. Aquamation is a new option just introduced into Australia. It's an alkaline solution in a stainless steel vessel. And like cremation, only the ashes remain. It's a totally natural process and the same thing occurs as would occur in nature. In fact, every animal would a fish since the beginning of time. Um, it's just that it's speeded up. CEO of Aquamation, John Humphreys, started the process just this year and says it's attracting wide appeal. It costs around the same as cremation. From an environmental point of view, it is far more eco-friendly than any other method and by a, a massive extent. And you still get to take away the ashes for the urn or vinyl records, gems, fireworks.
they really feel that it has been really beneficial to them to say goodbye to their loved one in that way. And everybody seems to be so happy about it. Helen Willings reporting there with some pretty amazing ways to say goodbye.